good morning it's 5 30 a.m on thursday morning february 25th one day before catcon and anna and i are just about packed up we're gonna hit the road for kentucky to host the first ever virtual catfish conference and we're gonna take you along with us enjoy the ride I've got just about every piece of camera gear and lighting gear I own packed up back here. Traveling through downtown Asheville to go see Anna's mom, and Anna's getting all sentimental because this is where she used to party. Party hardy, Marty. Back in her uh, heyday. Early twenties. Yeah, she used to get crunk down here. <laughs> First stop, there's the city of Asheville down there. It's a long way down. And you have no idea how, until you're down there, how steep this hill is right here. We've discovered some beautiful natural rock formations. Well, I'm not sure if they're natural, but <laughs> they're all over the place. Isn't that interesting? They go on forever. Welcome to Tennessee! We've arrived. There it is. Massive Monster complex. World. There's the boat right over there. The boat. The boat. I don't know how well I can see that. <laughs> and the truck that says Monster Rod Holders. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Hey. Boo. So excited! <laughs> We're here at the Monster Rod Holder Center. Ooh. Sitting up. People probably recognize this back here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> awesome. Here we are. Hey. <laughs> it's cool in here. Real that you've been eyeballing for a while and getting the feel how you got the good it job. is. Feel the job. action on, or getting the handle on the terminal tackle they got there. I mean. They, <laughs> All right, I'm all ready for CatCon day one. Morning. We're going to go get some breakfast, and Anna's going to drop me off at Monster Rod Holder Studios. We did finally make it to the hotel last night. It's your standard hotel. Comfy bed. Mm, super comfy. Super comfy. All right, here we go. All right, guys, we're backstage at the Catfish Conference, and uh, I'm in the Monster Rod Holder Complex, and these guys are working feverishly over here trying to get things set up. Say hello, fellas. Hey, Kevin. <laughs> hello. 
So we're trying to get things set up. We're working hard here. I'll show you a little setup we got going here. Got everything set up, ready to go, right here at the Monster Rod Holders Studios. On fishing line, uh, it's been something that guys can use all the way over here on the East Coast, all the way as far as the West Coast and some of the parts of Northern and something to give you a little Caleb's bit of up right now. We're behind the scenes watching Caleb. Pop on you uh, when that <laughs> fish is tournament. Hear that? Spanners I'm watching. Well, I'm listening to the catfish <laughs> conference I mean, you can while I'm driving Plus, to go see, see my, my dear friend Natasha. And say, hey, man, Road trip. And they'll tell you anything you yeah, Mike Chavez cooking some delicious catfish. Well, yeah, I'm ready for that. <laughs> Shame we didn't have a uh, taste division or something. I know. We should have made Mike come here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we got, but we got sandwiches here, though. We yeah. Got sandwiches. And somebody's eating it. Look at it. <laughs> got Ryan over there. Is eating. it that time already? It's almost that time. It's almost lunchtime. <laughs> well, time is flying when you have fun. Yeah, that's right. Taking a lunch break. <laughs> we have some deli sandwiches some chips and y'all know i like the diet mountain dew just want to give you a little tour of the setup there's a big catfish mounted up here on the monster rod holder wall he's got a big flathead over there and the studio is pretty simple got a couple chairs here a desk microphone we got two computers going a big ring light just walk around here right outside of the monster rod holder warehouse so it's pretty cool to see where they're made and then right outside we have rainy weather Ugh. there's some nice pictures in here some nice art got the american flag flying that's a magazine i'm doing a quick tour of the monster rod holders facility here they got all kinds of stuff going on here's the monster rod holder set up who's that back there Oh, hello. Got all the new inventory in, just got off the truck. Nice little warehouse here. Again, we're in the Monster Rod Holders facility. This is where we're doing the streaming for the Catfish Conference. He's all right. All right, so I got some of Mr. Steve Douglas's employees here, and Steve is somewhere around here. I'm asking them, what is Steve Douglas really like? What is he really like? Right. Remember, you gotta, you gotta have a job after this is over. Right, right, right. Evan over here. He, he got me started with uh, Steve, huge fan. So when he first told me that he worked with him, I was like, oh my gosh, get me his autograph, get me in there, do whatever I, uh, you gotta do. Ever since, I gotta say, it's, it's been an amazing experience. <laughs> oh, okay. You I know, thought you were gonna say, he, I'm he, let down now. He's got his moments, you know what I mean? But I mean, <laughs> hey, uh, my fishing game has been stepped up tenfold since working with him. I've learned so much about this industry. Steve must be around. Yeah, you know, <laughs> uh, but uh, I have the best job, uh, you know, ever. You know, That's I've awesome. been doing this for a long time. I've uh, managed a bunch of different places, but uh, I got to say, I'm very happy where I am. We got any truth over here? I mean, all right. So let me lay it down real. <laughs> he's all right. No, I'm just joking. He's a good guy and all. He is. Hey, sorry, turning down. Epic sorry, Tim. Fish. Sorry, Tim. Yeah, sorry, I had to do it too, but. <laughs> Um, you know, he really does genuinely care about you guys. You know, he cares about the industry. He cares about the business. He, I mean, he put his heart and soul into this. So, you know, he definitely shows it on a daily basis and everything. But outside of that, as you may not know, he's super organized. You know, he has things ready before he's right. he releases he's stuff. He's coming. I mean, uh, I mean, uh, <laughs> <laughs> there you go. You heard it. Cre Steve kind of creeped in there. So I don't know if we got an honest answer, but... Uh... You guys can get with me later on that. Yeah, I got <laughs> Day two, here we go. Yeah! All right, y'all, we're at day two. We're about to kick off this show here. Uh, seems like yesterday went really well, and uh, a lot of people got a lot of good deals. And me and Steve, are just getting everything ready to go for day two. Oh my. Look how they got it at Monster. They eat sushi for mm, breakfast. For breakfast. Right, sushi for breakfast? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> when you love it, you love it. <laughs> man, look at that platter. Mm. <laughs> look at that thing, man. Look, I fit in. A glove is an understatement. Look at that. <laughs> Twist it up a little bit, but there we go. And look at that, he's protected 
by this Pretty. little webbing here. He's not going to get scratched up. Nope. Look, I, I can breathe. <laughs> How many times a day do y'all do this? I can. Uh, this is about the third time. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <Steve>. <laughs> So I just got a text. Oh my goodness, open that thing up. Oh no, I said that, you, I was telling Hervey that y'all upped it to 15. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, okay. Oh. He, he was I just was gonna do it. <laughs> I read it wrong. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> next time. What do you think? Uh-oh, no. How many it, rods? It's cheese. The, the offer was 10 rods. Who's gonna do it? Whoever wanted to, wait a minute, who's gonna do it? Who's buying the rods? Catfish Conference. Catfish Conference. Uh oh, full sp <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Now, what flavor is it? That is sweet and sticky. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad. Oh, mercy. The guys at the warehouse are screaming. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, I can't yeah. believe you did that. You should smell that up right My now. But can you believe that he ate that dip bait? How gross! <laughs> but cool for Hervé and the CatCon team for uh, supporting the company, buying ten rods for some entertainment. So trading a little bit of money for some entertainment. I know we had a blast watching it, and so did the guys in the warehouse. We heard them about twenty seconds later going, "Ah!" <laughs> Miss Paula Smith in here. Coming up, and my wife finally got here, and uh, yeah, we just we just took a picture where Paula and my wife are both taller than me, and we got Mr. Ken over here. Smile away. <laughs> We're at commercial right now. How do you feel now that it's all over? We're done. <laughs> hey, it's been hard work, but it's been well worth it. I had a lot of fun. I must admit, it was awesome. There you go. There's a super moderator right there. <laughs> I couldn't leave Monster Rod Holders without getting me an HD80. And I got Mr. Gadget's Rod Holders right there. Alright, we got the Wildcatters TV truck here. You know I couldn't leave Monster Rod Holders without getting a gander at this boat here. Check it out. There's the machine right there. Everybody's waiting on me to go to dinner just so I can get a shot of this boat. Check it out. And y'all see Steve uses the HD 82. I know that's the HD 150. There's that enclosure that Anna would love so much. We're gonna get an enclosure on the pontoon boat this winter so we don't have to deal with the weather either. Look how deep this thing goes. That thing is robust, man. I never knew that you had this back on the back. Yeah. So you really do draft a lot of water when you're in this thing. Yeah. Well, actually, it doesn't. You see where it sits in the water right here. It's not. Okay. It's not that bad. But it's just because of the high sides, then. Yeah. Yeah. That's what. You know, Paula went with me that one time. You know, she's like 35 <laughs> pounds. Uh huh. Herself. She has this 35 pound fish, and she goes to go over uh -huh. to let it loose. The weight of the fish is more than her. She is, and her feet come off the bottom. And, and she you had to grab her. her. No, I didn't. Lisa did. Actually. <laughs> Lisa nabbed her. <laughs> well, speaking of Lisa, I think they're ready for us to go to dinner. Yeah. Them ladies are hungry. Yeah. We're gonna go get some pizza. Alright, CatCon is over. I got my personal chauffeur here driving me through these beautiful mountains. We're all worn out and tired, but we had a great time. And uh, we're listening to two stands fishing right now on the road trip, so we get to watch, or she gets to listen, I get to watch some fishing. And uh, we're gonna stop in Asheville and see Anna's mom again. <laughs>